Good morning guys. As you probably know, Tassie's had a bit of a hard uh, hard season this year with the bees. We, um, we've been feeding ours, trying to get them ready for trying to get them ready for winter. I was using bucket feeders, but they're just uh, they're not keeping up. They're using more than we can put into the hives, so we're now we're now running a 200 litre of 44 gallon drum of uh, two to one syrup down through a spigot out to a soaker hose and a drainage any overflow goes in that bucket at the end and then we just put it back up into here that way bees don't drown but I'll see if you I can get it in here and you can see what's going on It's just mental. There's tens of thousands of bees trying to get a feed. Now we know we're uh, we're feeding the ferals as well, but uh, we rely on the ferals for our breeding. That's where a lot of our drones come from. So I'm happy to feed those as well. Not cheap though. 100 kilos a week in sugar at the moment that's about uh, 220 pounds in American money don't know how long I can afford to do it but if I don't I won't get my hives through winter so yeah just an update I put a couple of posts on this morning about how hard it's been in the in Tassie this season and uh, Hopefully this will just reinforce that. Some of my hives have got half a frame of honey in them. And it's only uh, two weeks and we basically in winter, that's when we light the fire. Ah, fingers crossed. Anyway, how about it go? I'll see you guys later. Have a good one.